First step. Push the gutta percha into the handpiece. Second step. Install the cartridge. Screw the cartridge along the thread of the handpiece to install. Third step. Use bending tool to bend the silver tube. Long press power switch. Turn on the device. Shot press S key to change temperature memory from T1 to T3. Short press main switch to heat. When the indicator light flashes, it means heating. When the heating is completed, the flash will stop and stay in blue. Holding down press the main switch to push out the gutta percha. Long press the S key to enter the temperature interface. The temperature can be set from 100 degrees Celsius to 200 degrees Celsius. Short press the main switch till target temperature. Press S key to confirm and enter push speed interface. Short press the main switch till target parameter. Press the S key to confirm and enter change GP interface. Short press the main switch to choose whether to change the gutta percha. Press S key to confirm and back to the initial interface. During power off state, press power switch to enter advanced setting. The auto power off will appear on the display screen. Short press main switch to choose the power off time. Press S key to confirm and enter the beep volume interface. Short press main switch to choose the volume. Press S key again to confirm and enter the restore settings interface. Press main switch to choose to reset or not. Press S key to confirm and enter the save interface. Short press main switch to choose to save or it. Press S key to confirm saving. During standby state, press S key to enter the setting interface. Press S key till change GP interface. Press the main switch to select yes. Press the S key to confirm. Firstly, the handpiece will heat to melt the sigil gutta percha. Secondly, the push rod pushes forward until the gutta percha is exhausted. Push rod direction and remaining amount of gutta percha will be displayed on the screen. After the gutta is pushed out, the push rod moves back. The gutta percha progress bar automatically returns to full. Remove the cartridge. The inside is clean and there is no residual gutta percha. If there is residual gutta percha inside, use medical forceps to clean up residual gutta percha. Unscrew the cleaning nut with the bending tool. There is no residual gutta percha on the cleaning nut. If there is residual gutta percha, clean the inside off nut with medical forceps.